It is the beginning of the end for the severe flu season. New numbers released today from the CDC show a decrease in flu activity, but health officials caution the season is far from over. Health reporter Stephanie Stahl is here with the latest in the Einstein Science Center report. Finally, the peak has arrived. Oh, we've been waiting for a this. A long time, yeah. right? Medical facilities, though, around Philadelphia and the region here say they are still very busy with flu patients. Pennsylvania has had over 74,000 lab-confirmed cases. But federal health officials say the worst of this flu season appears to be over. It does look like the peak has, uh, is behind us now. It's been a rough flu season, but the latest numbers from the CDC show the number of people visiting the doctor for flu-like illness is decreasing. It looks like it's down now, but the level that uh, we had was actually almost as high as we had in 2009 when the pandemic occurred. And so that's a lot of influenza activity, so we expect that there will still be several weeks more of influenza activity. The dominant virus this season has been H3N2, and while government health officials say there's less of that virus circulating, they are seeing more influenza B. The H3N2 affects more older folks with very high hospitalization and death rates, but influenza B does tend to affect those that are younger. Certainly, there's still a fair amount of influenza to go this season, probably until mid-April. So health experts are continuing to urge everyone who hasn't gotten the flu shot to get one. They also say sick people should stay home to prevent spreading the virus. And the CDC said 13 more children have died, bringing the number of pediatric flu deaths to 97 this season. The CDC also says about half of those children did not have underlying conditions and only a quarter of them had been vaccinated. Tough season, yeah. still lots Very of sick tough. people around, but at least we can see Even the end the, right. at the light of the That's long good. tunnel. Absolutely. Absolutely. Thanks, Steph.